I had someone tell me that trapping doesn't work. Mm -hmm. So it was a pretty established guy. I won't say anything. Okay. So we decided, I go, I can make this work. So we were gonna uh, go a couple rounds. Mm -hmm. So we got ready. I go, are you yeah. ready? Yeah. And, and uh, sorry, hold on. Are you ready? All right, talk to us. Hey everyone, Ed here from Metrolina Martial Arts here in Austin, Texas at Marshall Way Legacy with the man, Sifu Ron Balicki. Um, I have a couple questions for you, sir. So, I made a video a couple weeks ago uh, talking about the Ping Chi de Gua Choi series. Mm -hmm. And I asked a karate black belt, a current younger karate black belt, about this type of block. Mm -hmm. And he had mentioned that he doesn't know this block. Like, as really? a block, oh, okay. he knows it as something else. Oh, okay. Um, like like a hair pull type grab, something something where it's not an actual block. And it got into this big discussion, and a lot of people chimed in. Uh, a lot of old older school Jeet Kune Do guys hit me up, telling me where I was wrong, which is fine. That's that's good. Mm -hmm. I like I like constructive criticism. Um, one of the things I heard though was that it kind of the drill itself got watered down by seminars. So that led me on to a thing where I'm like, I'm kind of mainly a seminar student, right? I've done seminars with you for the past 15 years, mm -hmm. and I've done um, classes at Sifu Scott Shields Martial Arts Academy in Charlotte back, but I only did them for like three years. I've been with Ron for 15, so it's, I wanted your take on it because you were also a seminar student, correct? Yeah, I started, well, Kind of back and forth. I, I my, my instructor is uh, Sifu Larry Lindemann, mm -hmm. and um, obviously Guru Dan. That's how I found oh, well, Sifu Dan. That's how I found Sifu Larry. Mm -hmm. You'll hear me say Guru. You hear me see Sifu. It's because they hold instructorships in both, and and right. it depends on the class. And I'll <laughs> say it, but you know you get the idea. But um, so yeah, I would say seminar is a big part of my growth mm -hmm. in this, and. Um, you know, the difference I would say between seminar versus class is he's trying to jam six months to a year's worth of information right. into a weekend. Yeah. You know, and, and, and the whole weekend is maybe one section of C-Lot, one section of Kali, one section of, you know, JKD in the next day. So you're getting a couple hours on a weekend. Mm -hmm. So he's trying to, like, feed you enough information to where you can go back and, and kind of work that material until he gets to see you the next time. Right. So, so a class, you know, like the difference was uh, when I was uh, in Chicago, uh, see for Larry and I would just kind of like, uh, we had a system that was really cool mm -hmm. because we wanted to kind of devour everything he had to feed us. Right. So we, uh, uh, one guy would usually watch in tent and it'd be like, he's doing this and this, while the other guy was just scribbling down everything. And right. that was our system. Okay. So then afterwards we'd run back to the hotel room or wherever, what state we were, mm -hmm. and we would just go, all right, let's get this and get this mm -hmm. and we drilled it and you know and then we go home and work it and yeah. then you know six months later or whatever we got to see Sifu Dan again we go show him it he goes well that's good but that's not what I showed you and I go really yeah. and, and he goes no but I like what you're doing and, okay. and, and that came to the creativity side okay the conceptual side which everybody you know there's a whole war of uh, you know original yes. and uh, nucleus and uh, you yeah. know all this other stuff and conceptual and and you know I'm proud of it. We're, yeah. we're conceptual. Yeah. You know and and you can say what you want. This isn't the way Bruce Lee did it, but you know get out of the 70s. Yeah. I mean it, know, it, it, the, my comment section is is I don't know if I'm a, answering the question. No, you are. You you, okay. you did. So like and, and I've had I've had a lot of this experience now where I'll have uh, certain different Jeet Kune Do lineages come at me from these different perspectives, which is cool to hear, but sometimes they're coming with the wrong intention. So when you're commenting on my videos, be nice. Um, <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't be nice. Don't be nice. Bring it. Bring it. <laughs> well, yeah. the, I, when I say be nice, it's like... It, be respectful. Yeah, we, well, uh, if you're nice, what, what is it like... Um, I, I heard it yesterday where it was like, flies are on shit, but like bees to honey. Like, like which ones, like if bees go to honey, right? I don't know, I fucked that up, but it's not important. <laughs> but the idea is, is like, if, if you're gonna come at, I love criticism because it does, it's gonna make me better. But the idea with it is, is like, if you're coming like, hey, this is how th they did it, I'm like, oh, that's cool. But if you're like, you're doing it wrong, 
this is how it's supposed to be. Right. It's like, are you, who, who, well, you know, I love respectful questions and that's mm -hmm. what I was talking about. And they can be hard questions. Yeah. But I could tell like a gotcha question versus, yes. hey, I genuinely want to know. Right. And to say you're doing it wrong, kind of, I, I cringe a little bit. Yeah. You know, because for one, like we, we uh, I'll go outside of the JKD area. Mm -hmm. we, we do a lot of knife stuff. Right. All right. And I'll get people ahead of this week. Just slam me. You're never going to get that in a knife fight. Why do it? And I'm like, you're, I know you won't get it in a knife fight. Right. Because you don't train it. You don't give it that fair time and grade. Mm -hmm. And you know me. I talked about this yesterday. Right. The Fosbury flop. Right. Yeah. Okay. You know, before that high jumps were how? Uh, they you well, jump that way. Right. Yeah. So now they're breaking records. Right. Diving going, over backward. Right. But they laughed at him at the start. They right. said, can't be done. And so you judge, I hate to assume he, he's, I'm, all right, here's my curse word of the day. Don't judge the art on your lame ass. It doesn't mean that it doesn't work. Right. You know, um, my other big story, and I'll say it now, is uh, I got my start in the movie industry pretty much on a TV show called Power Rangers. Some people laugh and go, but hey, it was work. Yeah. All right, but the, the coordinator, Jeff Pruitt, was awesome. I love this guy. He would give a lot of newbies a chance. And when you came in, we'd all work out and kind of show our cool stuff that we could do. Yeah. And this guy came in and was doing this radical stuff. Mm -hmm. And we're like, whoa, where'd that come from? He goes, I just seen it in a Hong Kong action film. So Jeff's like, what film? And he told him, he goes, I know that movie. Yeah. And he goes, yeah, it's in there. So it was VHS days yeah. back then. And uh, he brought the, the cassette in, they put it in, mm -hmm. and they're like scanning through. He goes, right there, right there. So you watch it, Jeff goes, that's a wire gag. Oh. But no one told that kid it was a wire gag and he figured out how to do it. Now, right. had I said you can't do that, that's it's a wire gag, yeah, he, he might listen to me. Right. But he had no ceiling. Yeah. And, and so to say that won't work, Ed, mm -hmm. you know, I mean, because I, I remember like my heavy grappling days, you know, um, I kept getting this one guy, in, uh, uh, you know, with one particular lack. He goes, I can't, I can't believe you get me with that bullshit. Yeah. And I'm like, you know, <laughs> it's not bullshit. It's, yeah. I'm making it work. And right. I believed in it. And it works. So, you know, my, my view is, look, I don't know what they said to you and I don't want to slam other instructors. No, but yeah. my view is, you know, if you, if you really believe in it mm -hmm. and if you want it hard enough, I'll bet you it'll work. Yeah. You'll make it work. And then, you know, back to my knife stuff. Um, I've had amazing days where I thought, oh, man, I got this. The next day everybody killed me. Yeah. You know, and, and, but I'd rather go to my maker mm -hmm. trying something than uh, nothing. You yeah, know what I mean, and and so as for like you're talking about, you know, yeah. uh, yeah. or whatever, you know, it, it could be a draw, it could mm -hmm. be a hit, it could be whatever I want it to be. I could go ahead and give you that shot. Yeah, you know, <laughs> no, but yeah. if I did that, yeah. and then if you black the well, it's right there, and then I can go. Yes. Who's to say that yeah. that's not valid in a strike? Who's right. to say it's not a block? Who's not yeah. to say it's whatever I choose it to be? Right. And if it doesn't work, my fault. Yes. Yeah, and. and, and I think that's where people got a little confused when I was talking about I could I said I couldn't make it work. I wasn't blaming the art or or how it's taught or even whatever, right? I was like, every time I do this, I can't get them to do this block. And that's so why I asked the karate person, like, do you have this block? Should I fight more karate people in the street? Okay, here's a little <laughs> story. I had someone told me that trapping doesn't work. Mm -hmm. So it was a pretty established guy. I won't say anything. Okay. So we decided, I go, I can make this work. So we were gonna uh, go a couple rounds. Mm -hmm. So we got ready, I go, are you yeah. ready? Yeah. And, and uh, sorry, right, hold on. Are yeah. you ready? All right, touch us. I got one, it's done. Yeah. And, and he went, wait, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. It's done, yeah. I got it. Yeah. And, and, and it was a little contentious, you know, it was like, <laughs> but perfect. I proved the point. Yeah. And, and that's, you know, where, where I stood with it. And, and he, he's like, yeah, okay. You know, he's, he reluctantly kind of like, conceded and said, you know, uh, it does. okay. Yeah, yeah. You know, it, it, I'm not gonna say that it's gonna work, but you know, like people say it won't work in a boxing match. I say, yeah. go watch Lomachenko. Lomachenko, 100%. Okay, you know, it, it's beautiful. And I, I mean, I, I get excited seeing it. I'm like, yeah. it's right there, he's yeah. doing it. And you know, and, but others will say that's no good. So, okay, you're right, it's no good yeah. for you. For you, exactly. You know, and my big thing in the seminar is I say, if you say it won't work, you're right. Mm -hmm. Because it's not gonna work for you unless you really drill it and make it your own and believe in it. Exactly. So, so to, to end the story, we win. Yeah. <laughs> so. To piggyback off that, you so you teach a lot of seminars. Um, how do you measure um, your students' progress? 
because like you might only see somebody like you might only see some of my students like Dennis once or twice a year. Right. So how how do you measure their? Well, obviously, you have to I can see, see Dennis more than that because he zooms with me. Right. That's so, true. So, but I mean, I get the I get what you're saying. Yeah. You know, as I I mean, we had. 30 people or something yesterday, so I'm not yeah. going to remember every face, right? right? You know, because if I'm going to seminar or seminar, with the advent of COVID, it slowed down. But when sure. I, I was hitting almost every other weekend, right? It's a lot of people. Mm -hmm. But you'll start to know. And then, um, like, I always like Sifu Dan, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm going to Dan. <laughs> yeah. um, he takes notes on everybody. And oh. I've seen it. Okay. So I'm sure there was an, uh, he might, like, he's famous, like, for a long time, I was Mike. Then I became Larry. Because oh, okay. Larry. Yeah. And I think it was Steve at one point. And then <laughs> I finally became the son-in-law. I was. Yeah. I turned into Ron. Turned into Ron. But I, yeah. no, after a while, I think he got tired because I was like, "Hey, Blicky," and then he <laughs> made me come up and I would do yeah. my thing with him. Yeah. But um, he knew it, and he he know he made notation. So like, okay. I know at the regular class at the Inasano mm -hmm. Academy, we all had a log, so okay. we had to say who was there, mm -hmm. what we taught, mm -hmm. and if there was any problem, because that way he could look through it and say, "Oh, Ed." Ed needs help with this. Yeah. And then, so if the next, if, he, if someone else taught the class, mm -hmm. they'd look at the previous thing and go, oh, okay, you know, so hey, Ed, let's work this. And try yeah. to like sharpen that. That's cool. Yeah. And so there was like communication all the way around. Mm -hmm. But he, I looked back and um, he had notes all the way back to the, the College Street days. You know what oh. I mean when I say that? Uh, no. Bruce Lee's school and College Street. Oh, okay. In, in um, Los Angeles. Oh, wow. In Chinatown. And, and you can see Larry Hartzell, and he had notation and everything. Oh, he still got it. Wow. You know, so he's got, you go to his house, he, he's just meticulous that way. And he, mm -hmm. you know, note taker, and he keeps it. So he's got notes on me. I'm sure he's got notes on you and all the other guys. Wow. And, and even if he, he doesn't know your name, yeah. I've seen him do a brief description. Maybe yeah. he doesn't say you. He'll say, all right, the crowd at... Mm -hmm. your school mm -hmm. I'm noticing and, and, and a lot of times it's not a reflection of that student it can yeah. be a reflection of the instructor mm -hmm. you know like oh maybe their guys are here and he's like yeah. you know, I'd, I'd like to see the hands get more or something like that yeah you know it's always constructive mm -hmm. and it's to himself he doesn't share right. well, I got to see it because I was part of that process for a while sure and, and he's you know he's that thorough with it. it's something I recommend any school owner because it's just knowledge is you know um, there's a man, uh, you know Fire Wars. I do, yes. Fire Wars I was so impressed with him. I don't know if I'm going off topic, but I think mm -hmm. it'll help. He had a map that he put up on his wall. It was I mean, not real big, probably like about that big. He had it made mm -hmm. and said white belt and everything he required to yellow belt and everything he required to the next color, to the next color, all the way to black belt. Oh, wow. Okay. Now, he would have little like bobby pins or whatever, you know, mm -hmm. like, uh, like like the little push pins, pins, yeah. And he would write a number on it. Okay. Okay. So, and then he had a master list. So number like 38 could be at stall. Mm -hmm. So then, oh, you've moved up. Oh, we moved. Mm -hmm. And then if you quit, he would pull that pin out and put a red pin there. Uh, okay. All of a sudden, if he started to have clusters of pins. Right. He got, I got a problem here. Yeah. Am I teaching there? Who's teaching there? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is this person. Hey. Mm -hmm. And he would audit the class and watch it and not say nothing. He would see, try to figure out the problem. Yeah. And then he would do exit interviews. Hey, would you talk to me? I know you're leaving. I'm sorry to lose you, but mm -hmm. I just want to know what do we do wrong? Yeah, yeah. You know, what can we make it better? And he would solve the problem. And and I look at that a lot. Like you know, he didn't get that from uh, C for Dan, but mm -hmm. I look at it a lot the way he handled it. Yeah. And wow, I think we strayed from everything we're. No, saying no, it's really. okay. But but um, it's just knowing where the problem is and then fixing it and having a student move on. Yeah. And it could be with something like that. Yeah. You know, uh, I've been to places where. Uh, you know, I, I've watched guys do things and that, and, and and I didn't say nothing, but mm -hmm. they're, they're teaching so I'm like, oh, I don't think that's meant that. Maybe I went wrong. Yeah. And I would research and I go, oh, I kind of think they took it to something else. Yeah. And I go, so what? Yeah. They're doing it. They're doing their JKD. Yes. <laughs> you know what I mean? And and after a while, you know, if they asked me my opinion, I'd, I'd share it. And yeah. sometimes I would not do it in front of them their class, I'm sure. not going to slam them, which yeah, yeah, I've been yeah. stupid in the past, and I've said inappropriate things like, <laughs> oh, that's not right, and I went, yeah. oh, God, I'm in front of all the students, and yeah. I shouldn't have done that, yeah. and uh, who might have said it's not right, you know, yeah. uh, but it, it's just, the main thing is, if you don't believe it will work, you are 100% correct, because right. yeah. it, it's not going to work for you then, yes. you know, and uh, if, if you do believe that there's something there, you just, what, what does heat and pressure make? 
a sharp sword. Yep. You know, a sharp, strong sword, and that's what you got to do. Is you got to grill it. You know, pressure testing is everything. Now, mm -hmm. I, I believe, I believe there's there's a, a time to just do this, mm -hmm. just do this. And you're going, but nobody blasts that way, right? Right. But I might try to grab and go. Oh. Yeah, and then you have that. What if, what if somebody goes to grab something here out of your pocket? Right, I'm gonna... Well, what are you doing? Yeah, I'm... You're doing, doing a technique. I'm doing a technique, yeah. All right. You, you don't know. Yeah. So, it, it's up to the person of what they want out of it. You think it's crap? Good. You're right. It's crap. Yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. So. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, I appreciate it. Uh, if you want more content like this, be sure to like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Hit the bell notification so you can my or any other handsome face I get on the YouTube channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, take care.